So it's day 233 of Hey What Are You Doing Today? And uh, today Ernest Shackleton was rescued. Or <laughs> not so much. Ernest, Ernest Shackleton found uh, found his way back to civilization and, uh, and sent out a, a, a party to rescue the remaining party on Elephant Island. Not literally today, but today in my world, in my life, that book ended for me. And I thought to myself, how many people have witnessed you know, this rescue, this great, uh, this great feeling of uh, of a challenge over overcome, and uh, you know, just a huge overtaking of uh, you know humanity, a huge undertaking of humanity um, towards the end of the. The book had just gotten, I mentioned, more and more intense. Um, apparently, beyond a beyond a, 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 a sailing voyage that never should have been accomplished um, on a small 22-foot lifeboat uh, across the uh, some of the most treacherous waters in the world. Uh, and then they had to make a uh, a, uh, a uh, they had to cross an island that had never been crossed before, and it was a mountainous island, you know, snowy glacier, glaciers and, you know, whatnot, and uh, apparently only one other group has done it in history, if I, read it, if I read it right. I mean, that, you know, may have been when the book was last printed, but, um, and they went with all the uh, provisions that they needed, and uh, it was difficult for them, uh, and they, you know, were taking their time and, and had everything they needed while they were doing it, and uh, and they, they commented on how incredible that uh, that uh, Shackleton and the two other men that made the, the the trip with him across this island had had survived, and uh, it was one of those things that you know after uh, after every uh, every obstacle was uh, was was overcome another obstacle would pop up and it was just like wow like at one point um they had no way to do anything except to slide down a mountain uh so they 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 hooked the hooked the three of them hooked each other together and uh cruised down the cruised down a mountain it sounded like it was about a about a, a thousand foot drop you know not knowing if they were going to make it or not just you know sledding without a sled uh, pretty scary thought that in the end they had to uh throw a rope through a waterfall and come down this this icy waterfall um and uh make their way out of it but i'm um, just just so many just uh, just 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 mind-boggling but there i was thinking you know how many other people have been at this part of the story how many other people have uh have gotten to take part in the story and then i thought you know um what is you know what is what is my story what is my personal story what do I have to to offer um, and you know I don't want to make a lot of that I believe we all have uh, good stories but uh, but uh, I'd really like to, to start working on mine a little bit better uh, make it a little bit a uh, little bit more interesting read I mean I've had some some interesting things in my life I don't want to make a lot of that some very beautiful experiences um, but uh, but where is my story you know I also came across the idea of being the protagonist in your own novel, looking at life as as that, as you know, creating creating the novel as you live. Um, it's an interesting way to look at to look at life. What what's the story that I'm writing? What is a you know what? A, but um, it all comes back to you know, goal driven. What do I want? What uh, you know? What do I want to learn? What do I want to be able to do? What do, how do I want to make myself a better person, all those elements, so, so I guess, uh, you know, I gotta, gotta, gotta find my story, that's it, <laughs> so that's, uh, say 233, hey, what are you doing today?